Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 9 of Let's Play Castlevania Lament of Innocence. Brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright, so far out of these five areas, we have cleared three of them. Some of which we'll have to go back to later on. But I don't think we have to go back to the uh, House of Sacred Remains ever again. So, why don't we go to this place? Wherever it may take us. Dark Palace of Waterfalls. Are they so dark that not even TLC would want to chase them? That's a dated reference. Oh, that was actually a perfect guard. And it actually knocked the skeleton back. He was probably just as shocked as I was. Alright, looks like there was only like one room to go to. Freak using the stairs when I mean, you can just jump, right? Okay, what is happening? Okay. Fishmen. They're a thing in this area. They like to walk around on the ceilings and then surprise you. Of course your uh, whip of lightning will do extra damage. So you got that going for ya. Frost Demon, and a Frost Sword. Okay, this whip is actually decent against him. Actually, you know what? I think I should switch the, wolf, the Whip of Flames. Oh, I'm paralyzed. Oh, I got a new technique, the Energy Blast. Press triangle during rising shot. Slams whip energy into the ground after a rising shot. Okay, so these are just like follow-ups to skills you already have. Looks like I'm going this way then. Okay, the uh, whip of flames is not as effective against the fishman as the lightning. Axe. Well, I don't really like the axe with the purple orb. Okay, it looks like I can't do anything about that. Let me see if I can get rid of this fish man. Oh, there's a heavy armor. Let me see if I can bring him over here. Come on. Wow, you're bad. Come on. Dude, like, can you at least try? Do I got to get him up here? Oh, he's actually moving. Come on. There we go! That's what I needed you to do. Because I cannot break that myself. Okay. Speaking of being broken, that's what's gonna happen to me if I'm not careful. Wow. The aim on this guy is so bad. I'm just gonna go this way. And uh, access this uh, hidden area. <laughs> the accuracy on some of these enemies is just garbage. I feel like the purple orb has been has been letting me down. However, I haven't really tested all the uh, sub weapons on it yet. Oh, it looks like a ledge I can climb. Um, let's see. I guess I can go this way, or I can go down. Let's see where this way takes me first. And she's not gonna take me anywhere. Okay, 
looks like it's a lot of ledge hopping I gotta do. What happens if I go all the way down? And it looks like I can go all the way down. But does it lead to any hidden stuff? Like, a thousand bucks? <laughs> That's what it led to! So now I gotta think about how I'm gonna get up there. Maybe I can, like, leap over here. No, wait, I think I should use my whip for this part. There we go, that makes sense. And up here as well. That takes me this way. There's a skull shoot over there. Okay, HP up, that's beautiful. And... Hmm... If I go this way, what will happen? Is this like some kind of warp? Am I- why am I riding a Beyblade? And I have to like dodge hazards as well? Oh my god, this is like Sonic 2 all over again. You can't block this stuff apparently. Looks like I'm being sent somewhere else. I'm missing a lot of money. Wow. That was fun. And I got sent all the way back there? Okay, I'm on the uh, second floor now. Well, basement two. So, it looks like I gotta go through all that again. If I choose to return. Okay, I guess I gotta keep hitting it several times. Until the lever is fully activated. The flow of water has changed due to the machine stopping. Okay, is that something I would want to do? Will it prevent me from accessing certain areas? I certainly hope not. Ow! Cyclops, what are you doing, man? That's Blue Shrek! What are you doing, dog? You need to die! And a lot of health, too. To be fair, I can't be surprised. <laughs> you definitely came up short on that exchange. And now you're short of life. Is there like another heavy armor lying around? Oh, nope, that's another Cyclops. It seems to be locked. You need a black turtle key to open it. Which I don't have. Am I gonna find that in the next area? Whatever it's called. Either way, it looks like we're not gonna be able to do much around here for now. Okay, I did not think there was a second attack coming. Oh, Lizard Man keeps attacking me at the same time as well. Blame me for taking these hits because the camera angles are not exactly on my side. There, get out of here. You're bothering me. Looks like there's only one room to go to, and it's up here. Oh, looks like there's another sub weapon available. Ah, it's the crystal. Well, let's give the crystal a chance. Shatter plane. Cost me 20 hearts to use, though. Alright, time to put you to the test. Ah, uh, you know what? It's okay. It doesn't really 
do a lot of damage. Like, it spreads the damage to, like, every enemy. But they take so little compared to what I would like. Let's try the red orb. Okay, they're hitting me, like, rampantly now. Oh my god, these lizard men are the worst! Seems like they always find a way to hit ya! Like, they know when to attack you! Really shitting the bed on this show. Okay, there. We're done with them. Let's see what else is in this room. Oh, another HP max up! I did not even need to use that potion. Okay, never mind. Guess we're going this way again. Because we only came here for like one item. Granted, it was a good item. Okay, I'm really low on hearts here. This could be a problem later. Luckily, I do have heart repairs. Oh, gotta be careful, there's a Cyclops coming. He's got his eye on me. Because he doesn't have his eye on anything else, given he only has one. And I missed the door, because I'm an idiot. No oh, wait, there's actually another door. Um, I think I should go... I should probably keep going this way. Oh, oh, frost Demons! Whoa! I didn't think it would hit me a moment from here! Let's power off. Man, your magic drains way too fast. Oh, another one! That actually made my work a little bit faster. Whoa! That was actually perfect. Magic trains way too fast for the relics they're using. Um, I guess I'll go this way. Sure. I switched the whip of lightning for the lizard man. Okay, I think it does a little bit more against these guys. Maybe that's their natural weakness, or is it because they're actually standing on water? Oh, I can't take any more potions. Until now. Let me go this way. That's a save point. Take advantage of that for sure. Alright, everything is coming along smoothly. You know, give or take. Not perfect, but we're getting through the game. We explored 61.7% of the map. Let's see what else is in this particular hallway. Other than more lizard men. Okay, what the hell am I going to be fighting here? I'm fighting myself? Oh man, I'm fighting a doppelganger? This is like a Castlevania 3 all over again. Okay, 
he has a fair share of my skills, too. But on the plus side, his HP is actually pretty low. Seems to be, like, resisting that relic pretty fairly. Okay, the third attack, you do get a bit of recoil, so watch out for that. Got a couple perfects there, I'm a bit surprised at that myself. He gets a fair amount of attacks on that combo. Now, okay, he's picking up the pressure now. And he just gets away. I have a feeling I'm going to be fighting him again at some point. But for now, at least we got him out of the way. Let's move along. Yeah, I'll take the cross. Oh, I forgot to switch orbs again. I think I'll go back to Michael's sword for now. It might actually be good. There's another one of those skull shoots. I'm not gonna take that one yet. Hmm. Something is not allowing me to go to that door. I see what I gotta do. I gotta, like, uh, keep those torches lit. But then I gotta get through the door in time. Oh, man. I almost made it. Alright, let's try that again. You don't even need the wolf's foot for this one. Hey! There's the blue dragon key. I needed that for the previous area. Okay, that's actually pretty cool. I'm happy I got that. Alright, let me go take that skull shoot now. Let's see what awaits us. If only this thing was a little bit slower. have a little bit more time to react and like how the hell was I supposed to dodge that reliably like I had no warning for that one or that one or that one well that part I was able to telegraph and we're done all right. Where am I? Okay, looks like I'm back on B1F. Oh, okay, well, I was not ready for this. How dare you not show me any respect. Okay, St. Michael's sword is not awesome, but if it hits something, it hits hard. So, I mean, it's not absolutely terrible. Alright, let's save again. Where is uh, my ratio at right now? 63.5! Okay, that's, that's pretty decent. Let's see what else is waiting for us. We go this way. Well, there's a map. That's probably something I need to worry about. <laughs> okay, that's map three. I think it's time. You 
picked a bad spot to camp, dog. <laughs> Sagos. Hey, come over here. It looks like the enemies get crucified whenever they're hit by the uh, sword. Like, I don't think that's what's happening, but it looks like it. Because they're hoisted up in the air. bothering me. What else is over here? It looks like there's a sealed door. Due to the strong water flow, the door will not open. Okay, we'll be, we'll be coming back here later, obviously. But for now, I guess we gotta go back. At least we got the map. So I can be happy for one thing. That I don't have to fight these guys again. Unless I so care to do so. <sighs> I wish you could rotate the camera. I really do. Now I gotta choose where I need to go. Do I wanna go right or down? What the hell are you doing, flea man? Oh, I thought they were all gonna leap over there. That would've been hilarious. Does it do little damage against the flea man? That's a bit disappointing. Seemed like a good idea at the time. And it turns out it's very ineffective against them. Oh, there's only one door. Alright. Great more frost swords. So, you know what that means. Thankfully not switching back to the Wilp of Alchemy. That would have been grossly pointless. Oh, that was all of them. Yeah, I think I want to go down. Let's see what's this way. And... An axe? Uh, I don't really care for the axe, although... The cross has been letting me down. Another lever. The mechanism has triggered the bridge in the room with the large waterfall. Okay. Guess I'll be coming back to that later. Let's see. I guess we're just going back now. Okay, I want to go straight to see what's in this door. Okay, we gotta make these rooms connect. Remember, I like to fill in the map as much as possible. For obvious reasons. Which I don't think I should go over again. Because, I mean, most of you that are actually watching this episode have likely watched the others. I guess we're going back to the Whip of Lightning now. Again, I'm not a very strong supporter of the uh, active equipment menu or the item menu. Because while you're actually going through the menu, you're not able to do most of what you want to do. Like, what if you want to jump? And you end up selecting an item instead. That puts you in a bad spot. Also, most of the enemies were not even moving. Until just then. I found that very odd. Oh, 
didn't know these guys had a range attack. Looks like we wound up back where we started. In a way, that's a good thing. So I do want to go back to that, uh, that area when I entered the skull shoot before. Should probably get that taken care of. If I went through all that trouble to get that wall taken down. Anyways, let's continue on here. Oh, lots of potions. There. Got myself patched up again. And this is pretty much nearly the first room. I want to go back to that wall we busted. Oh yeah, I forgot that along the way there's like that big cliff. Hopefully I'll be able to cross it fairly. So remember, it looked very frustrating to go through. Is this the way I want to go? Um, I can go down there, but I want to keep going this way. So let us do that. Get ready to deal with uh, jumping. <laughs> well, at least, at least the area looks a little different from the rest of the place. Hmm. Where do I go to now? Okay, I want to be able to go this way. Okay, I see what I gotta do. It's still hard to do. But it looks like I gotta get up there somehow. So let's try it this way. I think I gotta land on this pillar. How am I gonna do that? Now we're gonna land on over here, apparently. Alright, I'm gonna figure this out. I can leap. Almost fell off completely there. <laughs> Thankfully, I did not. Nope, it looks like I gotta, like, make a blind jump with that camera against me. Oh, that's gonna be fun. Maybe I'll just keep going all the way, I'll be able to land on it. Because I stopped midway. Ah, oh, I went over it that time. Alright, let's try this again. Because I think that's what I need to do to get across. Oh, I landed on it there! That's what I need to do. That allows me to get a super potion. Good thing I did not miss that jump. <laughs> oh, it looks like a lot of these jumps I have to do. Well, what? Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. I was facing that way, and it wouldn't let me go there. That's bullshit. I made that jump, but it looks like there's another one of those elemental bosses. So if that is correct, I think this is where we get the uh, whip of ice. So 
mean, look at this area. It's completely frozen. That's better. Do I have my whip of flames active? Well, I do now, so let's go. Hey Shiva from Final Fantasy, what's up? <laughs> Okay, she used a sword. She looks to be very, uh, mobile. Oh, God. So, most of her attacks are just gonna be dodging you. And she has a shield. Nice. Oh, I'm paralyzed. Oh man, that paralysis took a while to wear off. Okay, her attacks seem a little bit harder to telegraph. Because of how mobile she is compared to the others. But it seems like the majority of her heavy attacks are dashes. She's gonna use that uh, spinning blade attack. Oh, I broke the guard. Because you block too many times. That happens. Ow! Okay, I guess I'll be taking my whip of ice now. Holy shit, that was an annoying battle. The whip of ice. Awesome. Alright, I think it's time to actually retreat. Go back to Ronaldo's house. Like, I'm not done with this place yet, obviously. I'll be coming back for sure. But it seems like I got 60% of the map done, at least. Maybe there's a new piece of armor. I'm sorry I whipped in your store. Welcome. What would you like? What do you have? Ooh, a moonlight plate. Reduces damage from enemies by 20%. Is this fine? Would you like anything else? Anything else? Come back soon. All right, let's get the new armor equipped. Oh, that's going to be so much better. Um, I think now would be a good time to uh, call in an episode, so in the next part, we'll be going back to the Dark Palace of Waterfalls and uh, try to take on the rest of the place. Goodbye, everyone. Thank you much for watching.